Last week, for an entire week, my partner picked the clothes that I wore each day. And yes, I know the title of this video says husband. Technically, he is my husband, but I don't really call him that and it's better for SEO. <laughs> this video was actually suggested by one of you over on my Instagram and I thought, hey, this actually sounds like fun. <laughs> and so I asked Dan and to my surprise, he agreed. You'll see from the clips that maybe about halfway through, he seemed to regret his decision, but then by the end, he considered himself a style icon and a fashion pioneer. So I'll let you be the judge of that. I really love fashion. I really love making videos about clothes, but I'm also trying to reduce my own personal harmful impact on the environment and on workers by taking a more ethical and slow fashion approach. And I want that to translate to the content that I make about clothes too. No new clothes were purchased in the making of this video. Dan created all of the outfits from items that I already owned and were in my wardrobe. If you know of any slow fashion and shopping your own wardrobe challenges and experiments, please let me know because I wanna try them and I wanna make videos about it because you're not gonna be seeing haul videos on this channel, unless it's like a Depop or a charity shop haul. But that's not really going to be the focus of the fashion content, but I love me a good slow fashion challenge. So let me know if you have any suggestions and also subscribe so you don't miss out on it. But without further ado, here is my week of outfits picked by my partner, Dan. And yes, you're welcome. There's lots of Dan in this video. <laughs> Morning. Good morning. Okay, what am I wearing today? What, what activities are you engaging in? Potentially doing some filming and then mostly desk work and then I've got a um, Patreon live stream this evening. And at some point I should probably go outside. So much stuff in it. Yeah. Are these more dungarees? Yeah, they're dungaree dresses. I feel like these trousers if you go outside, bro. What would you risk that so It's all because I've got tights on. Did that fall off or are you picking the sequins? Oh, no, this fell off. Okay. You're not wearing sequins in the house. <laughs> in the house. <laughs> this is very much a, a, an outside item. If you insist. Just, just made up grease. Yeah, okay, what am I wearing with them? Are well, you going to have to wear a top one? Yeah. Da da da. What colour is it? It's lots of colours. Oh, yeah, it's not work here. This is why I wear the same thing every day. <laughs> you doing okay? Well, this one, go real jazzy. Wow, that's gonna be real chaotic. <laughs> no, I'm, you decide. It doesn't work. Remember, there's a, such a thing of, as layers. I don't really like any of these. You don't like any of my clothes? No. <laughs> no. Put those two bits on. Okay. Um, this is what you've created so far. It's mm. stressful. <laughs> okay. Are we starting from the beginning? I feel like I need a different top, Hannah. You can keep dungarees. Okay. Maybe that works better. Use all the Lucy and Yak stuff together. Oh Maybe that's God. better. It's gonna be a massive Lucy and Yak outfit. <laughs> How about that one? Let's try that one. Nah, I don't think the colours gonna work, are they? I'll try it. Okay, attempt. I'm happy. Two. I'm happy with that one. Yeah? <sighs> yeah, that one's better. You did pick like a really difficult item to style. Orange, orange with orange, so. I'm not mad about it, but what am I going to do about getting cold? I don't know, I think this is also orange. Is this another Lucy and Yak? It's all Lucy and Yak, yeah. <laughs> there we go. You happy with your creation? I think it looks wonderful. Thank you. I'm dressed now. Yeah, I could do jewellery. Oh, yeah. You do you want to do accessories? Pick my hairstyle? Are we going full shebang? Pick your hairstyle. <laughs> mm. Go well, on then. Unfortunately, pick... you'll have to do it. Yeah, that's fine. Well, I can't do many things. I mean, these would be the right the right choice. The if we're going all orange today. Yeah, but do they go with the style? They might be the right colour. Yeah, they've they probably been much. Eh? Oh, these ones. Found them. Yeah. They're the ones. Which ear piercing? Oh yeah, that's good. Maybe just like. What are you going at the moment? Problems instead of the hoops. I oh, Dan is now in charge of recording. <laughs> Good combo. Mm -hmm. What are you doing? I wasn't expecting you to, you don't have to do my hair. <laughs> just go with real simple. I know it's a bit messy. Oh, I'm getting my hair brushed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm helping. Why yeah. are you laughing at me? Oh, I like it. 
if we pick clothes in the evenings, then we won't do this again. Do you feel more confident doing this now that you've got long hair? Yeah. What have you created? Oh, this is the back. And then this is the front. Oh, yeah, hello. Oh wait, if I do go outside, what shoes should I wear though? Oh, shit. <laughs> we can figure that out later. Okay, let's figure that out later. I'm going for a walk and so Dan needs to pick my shoes and coat. I feel like it's an easy decision. Yeah, is it? What yeah, shoes? Oh, my orange trainers. They just wear those ones. Yeah. I don't know if to go for orange or go for red, I think. Orangey. That's yellow. Well, uh, mustard. Okay. And you can have this scarf as well. Thank you. What do you think of your creation? You are dressed. I'm dressed, just that. You look alright. Yeah, okay. It's not a complete disaster. No, I'm just going for a walk around the park. I don't really care what I look like. It has been a successful day. I have been very comfy all day in the outfit that Dan picked out for me. My only complaint is just a general dungarees complaint, which is that it's really difficult <laughs> to go to the toilet, especially when you have a jumper over the top of your dungarees because you have to take the whole jumper off and then take your dungarees down. Also, the hairstyle that Dan did for me, it's still up, even though it's like the loosest thing. I've not even seen what it looks like, but I'll see when. I look through the footage of this video. But yeah, it somehow still stayed up, like the hair hasn't fallen out, which genuinely shocking. Do I rate them? Is this what we're gonna do? Like every day, do we rate them? I do see these dungarees as more of a spring summer item, not winter, because when I did go out for my walk, whilst my top half was nice and snug, my legs were a bit cold because this material is quite thin, but it's very comfy. I think I would give this outfit a seven out of 10. I don't think there's anything special about it. It's just like, it's just good and it's comfy and it's great. It's fine. Good morning. <laughs> good morning. Day two. What are you doing today? Filming this morning and then just at my desk all afternoon. That's your favorite dress of mine. <laughs> Well, it's actually, I know Tom is actually a winter dress. Yeah, because it's thick. I Despite can't really fact, wear it. It's got sunflowers on I can't it. really wear it in the summer, it's too thick. So that. Mm hmm. Then we go with. Grey tights? Yeah. Yeah, this is, this is a look, one of my favourites. <laughs> I feel like you're just copying something you've seen me wear before. You've only got so many gloves. <laughs> Thank you. There we go. You happy? It works. It does work. I like it. Okay, jewellery. I feel like you've got a sunflower thingy. It's not a sunflower, but it's like sun, maybe? Sun vibes? I think these ones. Okay. Yay. What about my hair? Oh, I don't, that's fine. You've already got it. Um, no, I put it up like this to shower. Here we go. Final look. Da, 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 da. I'm going outside. Will you pick my shoes and my coat um, and accessories? You can wear these boots. Oh, nice choice. I actually need to get these boots re-heeled because one of the heels has completely worn away and the other hasn't. So I feel wobbly when I walk in them. And that coat, yeah, that's a good shout. And that scarf, do I get to wear a hat or no? Is it cold? You want to wear a hat? I don't know. You got hair. Okay. creation I'm gonna continue with the ratings and today I'm gonna give Dan and this outfit an 8 out of 10 how oh, do I give it a 9 I don't know it's just like it's so comfy it's something that I always wear favorite dress we love a gray jumper it's just to win it but is there anything special about it again or is it just special because it's comforting and great. Eight and a half. Eight and a half out of ten. Good morning.
morning, day three. Are you sick of this yet? Yeah. What are you thinking today? Trousers. Some more Lucy and Yak. Rainbow trousers. And a jacket. Like this? No, not like that. <laughs> oh! This is 100% an outfit that I would pull together in the summer. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm gonna be so cold. There we go. I do like this outfit. Right, but what am I doing with my hair and accessories? Mm. You, get, you can have these ones. <laughs> okay, yeah. I meant to wear these on our wedding day and just forgot to put them on in the morning. No, oh, that's nice. Yeah. Mm. I know what to do with the hair. I will say I do have a preference today because of the photo shoot tomorrow and I want wavy hair for it. Put it in plaits. I'm not going to let you put it in plaits. No, I'm not capable of putting it in plaits. But can we say it was your idea to put it in plaits? Yeah, French, 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 French plaits. French plaits, okay, right, I'll do that. I did it. This side is always better than this side. I just don't know how to make it <laughs> the same on both sides. Dan? I'm cold. Weakness. <laughs> this is definitely summer clothes. My arms and my ankles are cold. You interested in helping helping a girl out? Yeah, can do. Let's roll. Okay. <laughs> I've spent the whole morning shivering. Those are all t-shirts. They're long sleeved. Long sleeves. Well, they like this one. It's like the only one that will really go. With it. Maybe the black one. Mm. Here you go. Wearing the husband's clothes? Yeah, go on. Dan dresses Hannah for a week and makes her wear his clothes? Yeah. Okay. The okay. neckline does not line up. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. Also, how do you wear this? It's so scratchy on the inside. I don't even wear anything underneath it. Yeah. Uh, you have this scratchiness on your nipples. Uh, is this it or are we <laughs> changing? <laughs> That's a dress. I mean, it's a shirt really? that I wear as a dress. Put it on, tuck it in. Are you kidding? Oh my God, no, I will. Just to show you how fucking ridiculous that will look. Look, I've got to learn, okay? Got, <laughs> you can't expect me to know these things intuitively. Okay, one sec. <laughs> Stan's reaction to what this looks like. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is going to sound weird. I don't hate it. I don't hate it completely. I don't hate it. It's, a, it's quite an intense look, I'm not gonna lie. I think the shape works really well, and yeah, then yeah, I'm... Yeah, it's because they're like really high-waisted trousers, that's why I wanted to put you in a shirt, but... The, um... Chuck that over the top of it. Are you... <laughs> <laughs> Do it! <laughs> Do it now! I think we made it worse. You think? Maybe we need a different jumper just to like mellow it out. We want to cover over a bit of the pattern, but we don't want... Do you Cardigans and stuffers on the left. Else, anything else that's open fronted? Uh, a green hoodie that's in the jumper drawer. Green? Mm. <laughs> it's kind of like green. Yeah, it's like a greeny yellow sick colour. <laughs> it's fucking horrible. <laughs> You've seen me wear this all the time. It like is... I don't really know. pay this much attention though. <laughs> I mean, I'm very warm now. I feel very cosy, but... This cardigan I mean, works over like dark colours, not like yeah. bright tones. It doesn't work. Oh, actually, that might not be so bad though. The yellow one? Okay, okay. Okay, here we go. We're done. That's it. This is it? That's the look. Okay, it's not something I would have put together, but I'm not mad about it. It's a powerful look. Is it something that I would put together again myself? I'll think about it. <laughs> what does it say? <laughs> it says. I'm busy and slightly erratic. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. I'll take it. Yeah. Great. Now I just need to warm my ankles. Well, roll your fucking trousers down, you lunatic. Well, no, because it doesn't look good fully rolled down because I'm too short. Well, anyway. It's not fully rolled down, just lose one fold. I don't think that looks as good. There you go. Don't you look, you, 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 you look like a clown. Yeah, it, suddenly I am a clown. It's like I wasn't a clown before, but now I am. Well, just put some fucking long socks on. That's what I was gonna do. Put some long socks on. Let's look for some appropriate, appropriate footwear. What we got? Boom. Ooh. They're the ones. I didn't that's even know I had these. That's what you want. Yeah. It's 
it's outside time. I'm gonna be really interested to see how you figure out what coat layer to put on top of this because I would struggle. Really? Okay, yeah. I mean, it's, it's the, I think it's the only practical choice because all of my other ones are too short. Oh, and then you've got yellow, orange, red, and then you've got yellow, orange, red. Yeah, the yellow scarf again. Let me just... <laughs> No, that's not how I wear it. What are you doing? No, stop. Shoes, just wear your orange trainers. Orange trainers? Mm. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm keeping the big socks on. A whole day wearing this. It's very comfy, but I'm still not convinced. Like, I can't, I can't tell. I don't think this yellow goes with this orange, but if we just do this look, I'm, I'm conflicted because this pattern is an animal print, but it gives an animal print impression. And what I've heard people say before is that animal print is a neutral. And so this is the neutral and then this is the, <laughs> the pattern. It's given me food for thought. And I'm trying to think how I would rank this outfit because on the one hand, I'm like, it's weird. I don't, think it works but on the other hand I'm like hello I'm interested there's potential here or oh, I don't know and also it just like I think the silhouette is good I really like the silhouette it's just the patterns that I'm confused about so yesterday I gave a very comfortable outfit an 8.5 it was a safe outfit this is not so safe but I actually think I prefer it to the Monday outfit. So I'm gonna give this an eight. I'm give it an eight. There's just something about it, even though I'm prepared for people to be like, it's awful, Hannah, what the hell are you thinking? But I don't know, I just need to get like more shirts like this. One thing that was annoying though, is every time going to the toilet, because this shirt is so long, I am a small person, I am a petite human, and this is a size um, 14 maternity. <laughs> and I got it in a charity shop, but look, that's, I normally wear it as a dress. So going to the toilet and having to take it all out and tuck it all back in again, this is the other look. <laughs> now to take it all off again. So I have full face of makeup, hair and jewelry in because this morning I did a remote photo shoot with Linda Blacker. Dan is off work this week, hence why he is still in a dressing gown and so willing to help me get dressed. I don't think... Do you want me to keep wearing these earrings so I can change them? Yeah, we'll, we'll dress around the earrings. We'll dress around the earrings, okay. And also I've got like gold eyeshadow on just FYI. I feel like since you're in so much makeup, we should do a dress. Ooh! I did my makeup myself. That's reasonably thick. Yeah. No arms, but... It is also a very much a summer dress. Is it? Yeah, I don't think it looks very good with tights, but if you can make it work, Dan, I'd like to work. see it. Definitely not a winter dress. Yellow tights? Give those a go. Mm -hmm. I would describe those as a mustard. Mustard tights. My main concern is my arms, like yesterday. Don't want to be cold. So then we need to get some more mustard on the top, I think, to tie it all together. I, <laughs> I'm very intrigued. I think it's gonna work. I understand the theory, but I think the shape of the top, because basically the dress comes in here, so you kind of need it to be like Maybe a crop. Maybe try this because it's higher. Yeah, like a crop jumper. Yeah, that's the issue here, I feel, is because it comes too low, you end up where it's puffing out. It like looks a bit weird. Yeah. But good theory, Dan. It doesn't even cover my belly button. This is a crop top on me. Oh, I'd love to see that on you. Wow. The yellow is strong. <laughs> <laughs> so I can, show, I can show you a trick of how you'd actually secure something like this as a crop top. Elastic band. Yeah, grab me a bubble. Ta-da! <laughs> so 
bit weird, huh? It's a bit weird, but is this... Are we going with it? Yep. Okay. You happy with your new look? Yeah. It's just a shame it's Thursday today, not Wednesday. Oh well, hump day. I mean, it's a bit... We're halfway through this video. Yeah, these two colours aren't quite the same. Yeah, it's unfortunate, but... Yeah. I feel like it's always going to be difficult to get an exact colour match. But it's not bad. It's not a bad attempt. And once again, this is not an outfit that I would have put together, so thank you, Dan. <laughs> it's that time of day again. Hannah needs layers to venture outside. What are you going to add to this yellow? More yellow? No, okay, you're not going yellow. Fair enough. Some red. Yeah? Are we doing the yellow scarf again? Yep. I don't really have many outer layers to choose from, so... What about my shoes? Yeah? It's interesting. I'm not sure about the boobs, but I'll go with it. I feel like a witch. Oh, look, you're in mustard as well! Matching! I almost forgot to film this clip because I was just going to bed and very tired. But I feel like it was another unexpected winner. I know that, like... The yellows aren't the same, but I can see the intention and the aim and the goal, even if it wasn't executed perfectly. Also, I know my boobs look weird. It's because they're in a bralette. If I was, if I had my boobs in a regular bra, then they would look more like two separate boobs instead of one. People are now gonna be like, no one noticed that, Hannah. I noticed it. Anyway, oh, what do I give this outfit? I can't even remember what I gave other ones now, so I'm trying to like compare it to others. I really like this outfit for just the inspiration and the idea of making my summer dresses more versatile by shock horror, adding tights and a jumper. It's not rocket science, Hannah. So it definitely gets points for that because I love this dress so much. And then it just means that I can wear it more often. I took the thingy out because I couldn't get comfy leaning on the sofa with it and it- <laughs> This is not the look. I think I want to give it a seven and a half. Seven and a half? For the inspiration. It's lacking ever so slightly in execution. Good morning. Day five. Are you looking for my jeans? Yep. They're in the cupboard. This is the jeans oh, section. Yeah. You make me wear jeans in lockdown. This outfit's not going to be especially exciting. I think we'll just, you know. Where's maybe... your face? Under the hair. <laughs> hey. What have you got for me? I don't know, jumper. I'm assuming you can wear that. Without... Yeah. Might still need layers. Okay. Ta da! Who's that? Plain look orange jacket that you have. Right, what do you think? Tuck it in. Mm -hmm. I don't think I've ever tucked in this jumper. It's like a weird right. shape. Okay. Okay. This is your choice. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't know if I prefer it tucked in or tucked out, but it'll keep me warmer. Let's just say that it'll keep me warmer tucked in. Okay. Hair uh, accessories. Think. No, this is a chill outfit. Chill outfit? Okay. Quite like it. I'm into it. Thanks, Dan. Okay, thank you. I immediately like went to go grab a pair of shoes and then realised that you're supposed to be picking them for me, but which shoes did I immediately go for? I don't know. But which shoes is Dan gonna pick? Do you wear the orange ones? The orange ones? Okay. Thank you. Am I allowed a scarf? Yeah, you can have a scarf if you want. Same one? Oh, a different scarf. An orange one. <laughs> there we go. I finished work for the day, for the week, and honestly, like, being at home in my jeans wasn't as bad as I was expecting it to be. Um, but it is Friday night in lockdown, and so I'm changing into my pajamas. So I thought I would do my outfit rating. I really like this outfit. I never paired these two bad boys together before and I think I want to give this a solid um, eight and a half or maybe a nine. Is this one a nine? It grew on me. I was like not convinced this morning but actually like every time I see myself in the mirror I'm like cool. 
<laughs> cool, 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 cool. Also, I never um, normally tuck in this top, but I quite like it tucked in and it's also kept me warm. We love being warm. Eight and a half out of 10. It's a Saturday and so Dan is helping me pick my outfit in the afternoon. It's not the morning. We had a very productive morning. Dan made eggs benedict and a homemade hollandaise sauce. It was delicious. What am I wearing? I would like comfy clothes today, please. Comfy clothes? Lounging around Saturday, please. Lounging around Saturday? Mm hmm Maybe like these. These look like the comfiest of the trousers, I think. They are, they are. They're comfy. Yeah. You're gonna bitch at me if I don't give you long sleeves, aren't you? So, uh, maybe just like this. This looks like it'll work. Purple and red. We're prioritising comfort here, Hannah, yeah. not, um, not, not looks. You, wow, interesting colour choices. There we go. Hannah's very comfy. I don't think I've ever put this purple top with these trousers before because I wasn't convinced by red and purple. They're a similar tone though. Hair, accessories. Perfect, accessories, you chill it, you don't need accessories. But okay. Like, we don't want a... Uh... Yeah, I think I'll just keep my hair up. Yeah. I put it in like this so it wouldn't get wet in the shower, but it's actually quite a successful bun. I have such an egghead. <laughs> look at that look with no hair. I almost wasn't gonna go outside today, but it looks really nice out, so I'm gonna go outside. Dan's not. It's not raining, so go go even more colours. Yeah. More puffy. Actually, to be fair, this one probably makes more sense as you're wearing red trousers, but... No, because it's a different red. I think this looks better with the red trousers. Okay. Personally. Orange shoes. Orange ones? Okay, I don't agree with this choice. There is a clear other choice. Oh, maybe these ones. I mean, that's an option. Look at that orange with the red. Yeah, what? go on, put the black. Black, black always works. Black always works. May I please take my hair down so I can wear a hat and not be cold? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank okay. you. If you want to wear a hat, you can wear a hat. I would like to wear a hat. Do, 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 do. This outfit for me gets a six out of 10. It serves its purpose, but there is really nothing special about it and that's fine. I have got my icy advanced SAR this evening and so I've been on a Zoom workshop since 4pm and we're going until midnight and so being able to like be on my sofa and be on a call and be present and aware but in like comfy clothes like this is very good. Welcome. Oh. What are you, are you It's snowing! It's relevant because you're dressing me. Hello, I'm really small. It is the last day of this, so Dan, I find me something bit. appropriate to wear. I already did this bit. Well, I don't know. Just, just confirming. Right, we need something woolly on the legs. These look pretty thick. Yeah? They look pretty warm, I'd say. I personally find these really difficult to style, so I'm gonna be interested to okay. see what you do. Honestly, it's a piece of paper. I'm going waist so much. <laughs> I, get, I need to see them. Oh, okay, okay. I have come to the realisation that basically everything is high-waisted on you because you have no midriff. Well, no, it's all purposefully <laughs> high-waisted on me because that's what suits me. I think this is a look. I think it is, but I don't think it's weather appropriate, this kind of thing. I'm nervous that my legs are going to be cold because this is. Why isn't... your legs cold? Well, because it's not skin tight. Like no, the air. It, it the air. It traps a layer of air. Yeah, but it'll just escape out the bottom. No. Warm air rises. To my crotch. <laughs> yeah. Layer number one. So where does this go to you on the body? Because I mean, it's a like it's above my rib cage. So it, it um isn't really able to tuck in. It's oh, not long no enough good. for tucking no in. Good. But I've got this layer tucked in, so... How about this one? That one I will be able to tuck in. Fuck. Let's take the other one on. Back to flying. <laughs> the most common thing I wear like out and about in the company is shirt at the top. Okay. It keeps you warm. But actually, I think we're gonna go for like a cardigan. This thin summer cardigan, sure. There we go. Looking good. Do you think? No. 
Yeah, try that one instead of the, the yellow. Strip. Now we're talking. Do you want the grey cardigan over this? No. No. Okay, I'm real spicy. <laughs> yeah? This is style layer. Get that, get that one. Here we go. I'm not entirely sure what to think. Like, there's orange in this jumper though. So, it has potential, but I'm just, I'm confused by it, honestly. I've I seen this video, there's going to be all those wankers in Paris are going to be coming down here and like, oh Dan, we need your help for next season. Like... <laughs> okay, let's bring you back down to earth. <laughs> Come on. Coat. We just go like, uh, just the, the classic. We, do we have a coat that we haven't worn yet? We've done this one, we've done this one. I have some other coats that are in the other cupboard. In a jacket. Oh, we could go, no, that's not going to be warm enough, we need more. more more insulated, more coats in this cupboard. Yeah, but I don't know if any of them will work. Try this one, yeah? This is a fancy coat, but I don't think the outfit no. is fancy. No. <laughs> it's a casual outfit. We need a casual coat for a casual we'll outfit. Let's go this one. Okay, more casual. Slippers. I mean, shoes-wise, what you got? In terms of most appropriate for snow, these ones or these ones? I mean, these were really a bit fucked. You want clean? Dan's outfit. May I wear a hat and a scarf? You may. To be fair, I think you, the, the thing is those trousers are so wide at the bottom it makes your feet look fucking tiny. My feet are tiny! I know, it's just quite funny. You need some like big... You need some like big chunky Doc Martens with them or something to really uh, get it going, you know what I'm saying? I need to give this outfit a rating. I will be honest, it is my least favourite of the week, so ending on a high. But I think it's got more to do with the fact that I'm just not a fan of these trousers. I love the colour and I love the idea of them, but I just, I don't know, I just don't think they're me, like, other than the colour. <laughs> it's like the shape and the style of them I just don't think works on my, like, small body, <laughs> on my, like, short small body. I appreciate the, like, orange and the orange. I think I would have liked this outfit better if um, maybe it was just this because the trousers are so loose and like because they're not fitted to my figure but then this is then it balances out whereas instead I'm now left with like two items of clothing that don't <laughs> hug my body and I like being hugged also my legs were very cold in these when out in the snow. It did not insulate. <laughs> um, but other than that, it's been like comfy hanging out at home for the rest of the day. But yeah, I think I'm gonna give this outfit a five out of 10. Um, but I think most of that is down to the fact that I just don't think these trousers work on me. Or maybe I just don't know how to work them. I don't know. So here's a quick summary of the outfits and my ratings. And I also just wanted to gather my overall thoughts from the week. Day one's outfit got a seven out of 10. Day two's outfit got an 8.5 out of 10. Day three got a shocking eight out of 10. Although maybe not in this picture, like without the cardigan, it was an eight out of 10. With the cardigan, maybe a bit less. Day four got a 7.5. Day five got an 8.5. Day six got a six. And day seven got a five out of 10. Was I too harsh here? <laughs> I don't know. So one of the things that I really didn't expect is that most days, Dan put together an outfit and a combo of things that I have never done before that I hadn't even thought of. Part of me just expected him to kind of remember outfits that I regularly wear and just like put that together, but no, he did his own thing and I appreciate that. Sometimes it was great, sometimes it was questionable. Jury is still out, you are the jury. <laughs> Somehow there was a lot of Lusignac. I think almost all of the Lusignac items that I own were worn at some point during the week, but granted, 
I do own a handful. One thing I did notice was that if I was dressing myself, I would have just gone black leggings and a jumper and not once during that week did the black leggings make an appearance. However, the first day <laughs> that I was dressing myself after the week, straight back to it. I was just like, black leggings, even wearing them today, black leggings. It's interesting for me that when I'm dressing myself and especially because we're in lockdown, I just go for ease, comfort and just whatever I can throw on really quickly. But Dan was rising to a challenge and so he took his time and he was intentional with it in a way that I'm really not when I get ready in the mornings these days, except on filming days. This was intentional, <laughs> but most days, no. But it led to me wearing lots of different outfits during the week rather than just variations of the same. And I really appreciated that because it actually made the days feel less like they all blended into one. Maybe the snow also helped with that. And even today, instead of just wearing this top over my leggings, I added the dungarees and I added this cute little caterpillar <laughs> brooch thing. So I don't know, some days I think I'll just still be lazy, like leggings, jumper, comfort. And then other days I'll be like, actually, what can I do here? What shall I do? Thank you for watching. Do give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And let me know in the comments which outfit was your favorite. How did Dan do? What are your ratings? Now I'm just asking people to rate my body <laughs> in YouTube comments. Maybe not the best idea. Rate the outfits. The outfits. <laughs> I hope you're well and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.